Hi, thanks for uh, talking to us at Synaptics today. We have a couple of things we want to show to you. One is our ClickPad 2.0, our Force Pad, our new fingerprint sensor on the HTC One Max, and what I'm going to show you here is a one millimeter stylus working as a demo on the Galaxy S4. So this is a one millimeter stylus. What we have here is a, a ball bearing glued on the end of a one millimeter pen, and this is an S4 that's been modified, the firmware's been modified on it. So I'm gonna use a Touch Explorer application that we have on Google Play and draw. And here you can see I'm just taking the pen, drawing on it has very good linearity and accuracy. I can do it at the edge. That's my hands waving a little bit. And in addition to that, so I can just pick up a random pen, like this one's from Hilton. So that works well, this Synaptics demo phone pen. And they're all working fairly well. And what this does is it allows you to use just any standard stylus you're able to pick up, or you can use the special one offered by the OEM, but you do not have to add weight and cost to the phone that you would with like a Wacom solution or an Entrix solution. This first device that I'm showing here is the HTC One Max phone. And what we have on the back here is they've integrated our swipe fingerprint sensor onto the back. So what that allows you to do is actually authenticate with a simple swipe of your finger, it gets you in through the lock screen, and it's much more secure than a simple password. And so what I'm gonna show here is, is when I push this button here, I'm turning on the phone, it gets you in the lock screen. By placing my finger on the back and swiping then, it sort of, it authenticates you, and then gets you in, and gets you past the lock screen. So what this provides for the consumer is a very simple, easy to use way to authenticate themselves and get into their phone, and then also ultimately use it for other transactions such as on the web and uh, that sort of thing. So this is the HP Spectre 13. It has an ultra-wide aspect ratio, ratio touchpad and has special wing areas to do Windows 8 gestures. So to pull out the charm bar, I can just flick in and I can even select by scrolling down this area. I can go to settings, or I can just go to the start menu. I can also switch between the apps by flicking from the left side. These are two different textured sides, so even if you're not looking at the touchpad, you can feel if you're in the gesture area or the pointing area. Over here we have the HP EliteBook Folio 1040 that just came out in December, and this has our new force pad. We can actually uh, now detect pressure, so we can actually scroll, instead of scrolling like this repetitively, we can actually just use our force, so we can press light to go nice and precise, or we can press really hard and scroll fast. These are both available now on the market.